Is it the water pump again? It's gotten a lot worse. Looks like we've lost a lot of water. What can we do? Call a tow truck. You two look stuck in the mud. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to startle. Hi, I'm Marion. Earl, would you two like something to drink while you wait? Looks like it'll probably be over an hour. Please, come inside. We have air conditioning for the girl. Come on, sweetie. Please, have a seat. I'll get some water. I like your house. Thank you, darling. Thank you. You do have a lovely house. How long have you lived here? Only a few years in this house, but before that we spent 42 years in the city. Oh, I wish I had lived in the city. Jenny always worked as a bartender at one place or another, but I used to read. You used to read for a job? Read people, their stories. You read the flame, its flicker tells you everything. I'll give you a free reading. lost someone. It has darkened you deeply even though some time has passed. About a year. Your father? You never got to talk to him before. There is a message for you. It's under the hourglass. What hourglass? I never got anything from my dad but money. You will. From my father's estate, addressed to Melanie and me. Dear girls, I'm giving the two of you this hourglass to remind you that life is fragile and short. We haven't always been close, but I love you both with all my heart, Dad. Earl was right. Can I help you? I'm Marion. My husband and I, our car actually broke down here yesterday and we had quite an interesting conversation with Earl. You must be mistaken. My father isn't well. He's healthy and all, but his mind slipped away years ago. He did a reading and... He hasn't done a reading in years. I'm sorry, but I think I have a caretaker to fire, so if you don't mind... Life is fragile and short. Love you both with all my heart, Dad.